G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Draw with Jazza. I'm Jazza and today I've got a bit of a review for you of a newish art program which has a really cool feature called Infinite Canvas and the uh, program is called Mischief. So you can check it out by going to madewithmischief.com, the link is in the description. And uh, one of the reasons I'm sharing this with you is because first of all you can try it for free for 30 days as is common with many software, you know, things like Flash and Photoshop. Um, but the other reason I'm sharing it is because it's fairly affordable compared to Flash and Photoshop, which are uh, usually at least a hundred, uh, usually several hundred dollars. Um, whereas this program is a little more simple to understand and use. Uh, and it's got that really cool infinite canvas feature. So I'm going to show you uh, what I mean by infinite, infinite canvas. This is a pre-made drawing I did and you can see that I can zoom out and it is a picture inside a picture, pictureception, you might say. And uh, that is kind of fancy, but that's not all because from there I can zoom out even further to see another picture and then that inside another picture. So as you can see, this infinite canvas thing is pretty cool. Um, now I'm going to show you a quick speed paint of how I made that picture so you can see you know, how simple it is to use while I give a quick review of the program. Now, if you've used programs like Photoshop and Flash before, uh, this has absolutely uh, no learning curve. It's really simple to use. The brushes are on the right. Uh, there are tools on the right. It's really easy to understand. Shortcuts uh, can be seen from uh, the menu up at the top. It's really, really simple. Now, there are limitations uh, in that it's not kind of as versatile as these programs. Flash is much more for multimedia and, and game design, things like that, dynamic multimedia content. And Photoshop is uh, a little bit more uh, dedicated to editing images and stuff. But as a concept art creator and just a creative tool and canvas for mucking around and, and really exploring creativity, I think that this is a really worthwhile program to check out. Now stay tuned till the end of this video because I'm going to tell you how you can win a free version of this program. But as you can see, watching this video, it's got uh, layers as Photoshop does as well. So you can see on the right that on the bottom layer, I have my sketch layer. So I've gone through and done the sketch for all these things. And now I'm going through and adding layers and doing the line work of these characters. Now the lines are similar to flash. So uh, as you zoom in, the brush zooms with you. So, uh, you know, the size uh, of the brush scales al along with your zoom. Uh, but in terms of keyboard shortcuts, it's really quite simple. Um, the vector tool is really uh, efficient as well. The lines are quite clean and there isn't any lag as far as I can tell. Now, as you might assume, this is quite a, a large sort of image because we've got, you know, four images inside of each other. Uh, and yet I didn't have any problems with the program going slow or anything like that. So uh, it feels like it's fairly well optimized. Now in terms of there being limits with brushes or optimization or things like that, um, I'm feeling like as the program is quite young, things will be brought out, updates will come and you know that as the company grows, they will be able to invest more in the product. But that is my review of Mischief. I think it's really great. I think you should check it out. Now, if you're interested in winning a free version of the of the software, which is uh, it retails at sixty dollars USD, um, now I'm just going to put out a bit of a challenge for you guys, and you can enter it or you can not. But basically, the challenge is to download the free trial from MadeWithMischief.com (link in the description) and to create something and make something really creative. It doesn't necessarily mean you have to have the best art skills in the world, but use the infinite canvas in a way uh, that shows off how it's pretty cool, you know, just explore it a bit and, uh, and upload it as a video to YouTube as a uh, response to this video. So uh, I want to see you guys get creative. Again, um, it's a chance to win $60 of software for free. And I believe that uh, they said that they would like to feature some of the entrants on their social media and things like that. So if you want a bit of an attention sort of outlet for your artwork and also a chance to win some great free software, make sure to uh, enter this little challenge. I will give you a deadline. I'm going to say a month from now. So about the 5th of uh, October is going to be your deadline. Um, so you have a month and uh, the winner will be announced then. Until then, get creative. I hope you enjoy the software and this tutorial. Uh, as usual, the uh, reference file is in the description as well. So if you want to actually see the uh, the the 
picture that I did, the, the file, you can download that and open it in Mischief and kind of have a look as to how I made that as well. So thank you for joining me, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you enjoyed this review. I hope you enjoy the software. And until next time, I will see you later. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you enjoy my videos. You can download the reference files from this tutorial by clicking the link in the description. And remember to share any art, animation or game you make on Newgrounds.com. Until next time, see you later.